What's up guys? Peter from Panda here. Hey, just got something to deliver from, well, it says Comfort Research on the side, but it's this big giant cube and it's busting at the seams. And the reason it's busting at the seams is because this Big Joe XXL Foof beanbag chair needs to breathe and expand. Um, it says don't cut this thing with a, like a box cutter. So I've got scissors here. Um, this one is a seven footer and that's good for snuggling up with someone uh, important or uh, romantically. The, um, the thing I wanted is as a kid, I grew up poor. So I never had any of the things that kind of the trendy houses had, you know, the cool psychedelic uh, rooms for kids and uh, the comfortable beanbag chairs. So one of the things I miss right now is sitting down on a Sunday and watching Jay Cutler implode and I just kind of want to chill and sprawl out and watch that unfold each week. And I can, my only problem is I'm not going to have a beanbag chair. So it comes in this box, it looks like it's about uh, two feet on each side and inside here looks like a brain the way it's packaged up and I'm kind of assuming it's like a vacuum packed kind of deal. Wow, let's see. Yeah, I'm kind of look it out of here because it's wedged in there good. I feel bad for the people that deliver this because my guess is uh, if this thing opens up in the delivery truck, it could be a kind of a nightmare. Here is a card that comes with foof chair and important uh, information, please be patient. The chair will take seven to day, 10 days to return to its original size. Keep it fresh uh, to restore its shape. Follow the instructions on the reverse side for foofing. Broken zipper, uh, pull on your foof chair is not, the zipper pull is not missing. It's been removed for your safety. And so here is the instructions, the art of foofing. Remove the packaging, lift and drop, lift and drop, sit back and relax. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Pretty big. That came in the box. You're gonna wanna open this thing wherever you're gonna use it. Uh, some dust, you can see the zipper on this side, but clean it up, let it breathe, and then let's give it a try. All right, so let's take a little bit of a closer look at this ginormous beanbag chair. Uh, first of all, the uh, material, like I said, is kind of this felt-ish material. It's not super thick, but it, it feels like it's pretty strong. You can see here, you know, it's kind of like um, a fuzzy, soft, uh, kind of like a bed sheet almost, but a little thicker than that. Uh, you can feel the stuffing, and you can feel that you have these big shredded clumps of different types of foam, and they actually don't seem like they're all the same, exactly the same type of foam, and they're irregularly shaped like a shredded piece of foam. And so some of them are the size of a golf ball or ping pong ball. Others kind of feel like they're the size of maybe a, a small potato. So, but... You know, and it's kind of funny because it feels lumpy because of that. But uh, when you get on it, you don't have any, uh, you know, weird pressure points. Uh, it, it feels lumpier than I would have thought in some ways in that uh, you can feel the big pieces of foam. Uh, you know, whereas I was maybe expecting more like a smaller, uh, you know, uh, a tiny little uh pebble sized balls or something like that so you know keep that in mind but like once you get on it it's no problem the other thing i'll mention is that when you lay down on it ah oh, it is pretty comfortable for laying flat on your back and being kind of being able to put your arms up and resting uh you know in a kind of a fetal position it's pretty great uh, but in order to be seated upwards a little bit kind of like a craftmatic adjustable bed to watch tv you're going to have to kind of form the beanbag chair manually beforehand so you're actually gonna have to kind of bring it up and figure out where you want your back to be and and kind of build that area up with foam so that you have kind of a a little mountain there so when you lay back down on it you've got something propping you up otherwise it's gonna be kind of like laying on a big fluffy bed and you're gonna be too flat to watch a movie or something like that but a great place to read a book or your ipad or kind of just crash and chill i dig it and this is cool 
I can sit down, watch the game, relax. Kind of you can lay it the long way. Uh, it's like floating on a on a cloud. But the best thing is sitting here on a Sunday watching Jay Cutler implode. Big Joe XXL. Fourth beanbag chair, Peter Von Panda. Out!